We do continue to follow this news alert for you. We do have some new information regarding those suspicious packages found at the post office on Miami Beach. Let's get an update from 7's Liz Nagy. She's on the scene. Liz? Lynn, we've been telling you all afternoon that Miami Beach police are looking for a person who they say is a person of interest who they think may have started this entire situation at the post office on Miami Beach this afternoon. We want to show you this picture. This is pictures that are, were taken on surveillance cameras inside the Miami Beach post office. They say this man walked into the post office at 13th and Washington Avenue about 2.45 this afternoon and had two manila flat envelopes that he was trying to mail to the F. FBI. But what is in those envelopes, we still do not know. Neither do authorities. And if they do, they have not released that information. But they said that man was acting strangely and then very quickly left Miami Beach post office. That was what spurred this entire situation. They called in the hazmat team. They called in the bomb squad just to clear the entire building and make sure there was nothing dangerous or hazardous inside those envelopes. Those pictures are difficult to make out because they were taken on grainy surveillance cameras inside, but you can see that he is wearing a long overcoat. He has two yellow envelopes in his hand, and in one of those photos, he is carrying a backpack. Authorities are looking to speak to this man to ask him questions about why and what he was sending the FBI. Now, we'll bring you back out here live to the situation at 13th and Washington Avenue. They have now just reopened the post office. There are postal workers that are allowed back inside. Several of them have come back out with large loads, loading them into the truck because they were not able to complete their mail routes. Police have now cleared the scene. The hazmat has determined that nobody is in danger, and now police are looking for that person. If you have any idea who he is or you think you see him, they're asking you to call police or Crime Stoppers. We're live on Miami Beach. Liz Nagy, 7 News.